With documentaries like Terror, the Human Rights Watch Film Festival creates a showcase for what it calls courageous individuals on both sides of the lens to empower audiences with the knowledge that personal commitment can make a difference. The film festival brings to life human rights abuses through storytelling in a way that challenges each individual to empathize and demand justice for all people. This year, a film called The Wanted 18 uses humor and stop-motion animation to explore Israeli-Palestinian tensions. The military governor came one day with his soldiers. He said, and I quote the exact words, these cows are dangerous for the security of the state of Israel. I can't understand how can 18 cows be dangerous for the security of the state of Israel. Saturday night, producer Lawrence Grant will present her documentary, The Black Panthers, Vanguard of the Revolution. The film features interviews and archive footage about the rise and fall of the Black Panthers. I say that Ronald Reagan is a punk, a spiffy, and a coward. I you to a jewel. What's surprising is how some archive footage resonates powerfully with current events. The thing that led to the Panthers was what we were seeing on television every day. Attack dogs, fire hoses, bombings. We stand on the eve of a black revolution, brothers. That connection proves the importance of the documentary playing at this year's Human Rights Watch Film Festival, as issues of race, injustice, and revolution continue to play out in American culture and around the globe. The Human Rights Watch Film Festival runs tonight through Sunday at the Museum of Photographic Arts in Balboa Park. As in years past, it's a festival designed to enlighten and to encourage people to ask questions and take action. Beth Accomando, KPBS News.